Hello there, my food plum perverts. Today we're going to do a food review on Blue Star Donuts and Coffee. We're in downtown Portland. Alright you guys, I am inside at Blue Star Donuts and they have a wide variety of donuts which I'm going to be showing you here in the next frame. Um, this is a more of an upper scale version of Voodoo Donuts. I've tried the donuts, they're pretty good, but I haven't tried the donuts at this location. I usually go to uh, Northwest 23rd, but apparently they have a lot of different varieties which I'm going to be kind of excited to try right now. So, here are all the donuts. I don't know what these ruby beauties are, but they look delicious. And then you got the chocolate almond ganache. And these little guys here, I think they're called orange olive oil. And these are a Meyer lemon and key lime curd. Now this is supposed to be like passion fruit according to the part, but it looks more like pumpkin spice. And then you got your basic vanilla, cinnamon, and sugar. And then you got the chocolate crunch. Oh, wow. The PB J looks pretty good too. Oh, uh, look. You got fancy meat and bacon, a blueberry bourbon basil, and the OG, which is a simple plain donut. So there's so many choices for me to choose from. So We'll be right back with my personal choice. Okay, you guys, so I ordered two donuts. Now, this Ruby Beauty that I mentioned earlier that I was really curious to try, I decided to try it. It's called the Raspberry Rosemary. And then this guy right here is more of a fancier version of Voodoo Donuts Maple Donut with like some very fancy bacon sprinkles. And we got milk to wash that down. They have a choice of whole milk or non-fat milk. I decided to choose non-fat milk because that's going to be a little easier to swallow. So now we're going to do a taste test on both of these donuts and I'm going to give you my honest review of Blue Star Donuts. Okay, you guys. It was a very hard decision to see what I was going to try first. But since red is absolutely my favorite color, I thought I would try the raspberry rosemary. So it smells a little interesting, it smells fruity, um, and I've never heard of them adding rosemary to a donut before. So we're going to give this a roll and try it out. Mmm. Very different. Very, um, very tangy. I like that. And now for our next donut, which is this guy. Actually, no, I should take a swig of milk to clean my palate. Mm. Because, you know, you never really want to mix the flavors together when you're simply doing it. So now we're going to try this bacon and maple baby right here. Oh my god. This is actually a nice little combo of maple and bacon. Not too sweet, not too salty. It's just the perfect amount. So. I can't decide between the raspberry rosemary or the bacon maple. They actually taste really super good. And I'm gonna have another drink of milk. And um, yeah, these are definitely gourmet donuts. So um, if you're in Portland and um, say, you don't really want to go to Voodoo, but you want to go to a more upscale donut, donut shop, this is the place to go. 
So this is my honest review of Blue Star Donuts. Okay, my food porn perverts, you know exactly what to do. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Also, leave a comment in the comment section and let me know where else in Portland you would like me to try next. Another thing is, if you like what I'm doing on my channel, you can also hit the subscribe button. And if you want to spread the love, please hit the share button and send this video to your friends. Well, I am signing off, but I will definitely see you beautiful people on Monday.